Now we planted this corn like June 25th roughly. The variety has plenty of stay green. Especially for being October 11th, there's a lot of dry corn out there. Well, those farmers also planted it almost a month before we did. We didn't get started planting corn until June 9th. Uh, but it was so wet around here. We got some lovely clay soil. It holds the water. In drought years, we'll have better yields than everybody else. On wet years, we'll just be later than everyone. Let's go catch up. This is the closest thing I've got to playing chase with the grain cart. Is meeting the silage chopper part of the way down the field. It could be slightly greener, but that's okay. A few bits of burr cucumber getting wild on us. And the Johnson grass. Eh, but you know. Now we've already got a lovely cover crop of grass. Uh, annual rye grass. And in some places I see some nice brassicas popping in. Probably some wild mustard. But, soil looks pretty protected, ready to go for winter. It'll grow in a little bit more. And we didn't spend a dime on seed. Yes, cover crops that take care of themselves. So most people call them weeds. You know what, I'll give you that much. Yes, our cover crops are probably weeds. What are you gonna do about it? Didn't have to spend any money to get them out here. They're winter annuals, so they'll die in the spring after they do their thing. We have all their organic matter. And voila, they're doing, they're coming in themselves. It is a bit thinner here on this hillside. The clay holds the water, so it can be very precarious in the spring on the hill. But then it can get very dry. Get back on my head. I think he's got to make a turn down here or something. Uh, it's going to be a tight turn. Now he got unhooked. I guess he can make that. I don't know. I'm sure he's backing up, but I don't know if I can leave my wagon here or not. Maybe, we'll see. We shall see. Don't come with me, wagon. Shit. Well, finally we got a nice chunk of dirt in the way. Extended the hitch out because this thing is so short. 